Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And yes, Christmas has passed, but Zoomus is not over. It's still December. So for today's video, I wanted to show you what I got for Christmas. And I'm not going to show you everything because there's a lot of like little random things here and there. I'll just kind of show you the bigger things. But first, I want to show you guys my new shirt because I'm obsessed with it. Uh, I didn't get it for Christmas. I bought it on Black Friday from Arm the Animals. But I'm obsessed with it. I love it. So here it is. As a conservationist, save the animals type of person. I'm obsessed with it and I love it. So first up is this antique book that my parents found at some antique shop. I don't even know when. But it's The Picnic at the Zoo. So I'm already starting my collection of zoo books pretty early. But it's cute, it's antique, and it's about a zoo. Picnicking at the zoo. So there's that. Next up is my favorite popcorn. If you've never had Boom Chicka Pop, you're missing out. Also, I don't want to say it's healthy, but like, it's kind of healthy. I mean, 120 calories per cup, gluten-free, and this one's going to have a little more calories than the ones I normally get because it is drizzled in chocolate. This is the dark chocolate drizzled sea salt kettle corn from Boom Chicka Pop, aka the greatest popcorn ever. Full bag, just for me. If you haven't had the popcorn, I recommend trying it. All right, and then as you know, I have graduated from college. I'm temporarily back home, but I'll be looking for a job and moving out in the next couple of months. So I got a lot of kind of house-ish stuff. Um, one thing I got is a towel set from my parents. And I'm going to show you the whole thing. I just have a washcloth to kind of give you an idea. But this is it. Bright, colorful, and elephants. So right up my style theme. Yeah. Colorful and animals. Love it. Then going off the whole house theme. Pretty much all of the like all of the kitchen stuff I've gotten for college is like a nice pretty blue. So my parents stuck to that. So I got this colander slash microwave plate cover, splatter cover shield thing um, for my parents. And this again, this pretty blue that matches all of my kitchen stuff. And also these Christmas kitchen towels that again are kind of zooish. Um, I've actually worked with, I guess these are seals, not sea lions, but I've worked with sea lions and polar bears and penguins so and they're christmas and i love christmas and it's my favorite color so matching the kitchen color theme this next one is my big expensive gift it's from my grandparents and it is the fitbit charge 3. i am so excited it's my first like new fitbit that i didn't get off of ebay i've only had the charge hr so i'm very excited to have one of the newer ones it's fancy and the most exciting part for me is I don't have to take it off to take a shower. It's great. I love it. And then next up, I actually picked these out and then just had my parents wrap them because we got my sister a pair too. But it's my Team USA mittens. And I love them just because, I think it's because I'm a figure skater. I love watching the Olympics and like following through nationals. And you know, go Team USA. I, I don't know which way to go. Team USA. But um, yeah, so I love these. I wish I had them last year when I went and watched the US Championships. But you know, whatever. I still love them and they're super comfy and yeah. This next thing is something I had on my list that had to do with my reptiles. So it's one of my reptile wish list items. And that is reusable produce bags. As you can see, I haven't opened them and used them yet. I haven't gone shopping, but uh, I'll open it up so you can kind of check one out. So this is what they look like. They're like a mesh. You can see through it. They're breathable. And they have this little pulley thingy. So you pull it tight. Whoop. And there we go. You're being eco-friendly. You can wash them, reuse them. No more little plastic bags. So I will use these when I'm shopping for iguana food. Because right now I think Arcadius is my only one that eats fruits and veggies. Kind of, sort of. So... These will be shopping for iguana food. Next up is another item from my parents. And this is because, you know, I'm getting into the jobs, like having real, like big kid jobs. And so, you know, you need a lunchbox. And I actually saw this at Marshall's with my mom. Almost bought it for myself and was like, no, 
gonna hold off i don't want to spend more money apparently she went back and bought it so this is it and literally it's like big girl lunch bag and it's covered in palm leaves and for anyone that doesn't know i'm obsessed with palm leaves and look how much blue is on it i just i love velvet i love it so much so this next item is actually one of my favorite gifts that i got and it's from my cousins and my aunt and my uncle and it is a tinsel for anyone that doesn't know tinsel is my sunbeam snake and this literally looks just like her it's all shiny it's black it's super cool and it's magnetic so under the head is a magnet and it sticks to any part of the body and it can be used as a bracelet or a necklace so wear as a necklace though i'm still trying to figure out the best way to do this but let me give you a closer look so there we go that's what it looks like as a necklace my mom keeps trying to get me to wear it as a belt so you can pretty much do whatever you want with it it's just a very long magnetic snake and i love it and then my boyfriend's parents gave me this cute stocking with their polar bear on it some airy pajama pants which are super soft and a $50 pet coat gift card and some candy so they're great love it and then lastly from my boyfriend I got this cute ring I just ended up to get resized though so I don't currently have it so I'll put a picture in right now so that's it for today's video hope you guys enjoyed let me know what your favorite thing was you got for Christmas down in the comments don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell and we'll see you for the next video